With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Constant KC values respectively for the reactive SO3 give rises to H plus and H SO3 minus and H SO3 minus give rises to H plus and SO3 2 minus are 2 into 10 to the power minus 2 SO3 2 minus. So as we can see that first equation if we write H2 SO3 reversibly give rises and the equilibrium constant equilibrium constant of this equation is given and that is 2 into 10 to the power minus 2. So if we assume the equilibrium constant as k1 and the value is 2 into 10 to the power minus 2 and after that we can see our next equation is H SO3 minus reversibly give rises to H plus and SO3 2 minus. So if we assume this as equation number 2 so the equilibrium constant denoting k2 value will be given as 6 into 10 to the power minus 8 and the unit are same mole per liter so these are the equation from which we have to find out the equilibrium constant value or the kc value of this equation so if we write this equation we can see that h2 so3 reversibly give rise to 2h plus and so3 to minus so from these two equation how this reaction will come we have to find out so it is simple we can see that if we add both of this equation our resulting equation will be formed how we can see that when we add this equation then this will be this will be eliminated and the main resulting reaction will be H2 SO3 on left side only and this 2H plus will be added and added will be added as 2H plus and this is remaining we will write it as SO3 minus 2 so you can see that this is our resulting equation so whenever we add the reaction the equilibrium constant will be varies as we are assuming this is as Kc we have to find out the value of Kc so whenever we add this equation the equilibrium constant will be multiplied for the resulting equation so if we multiply this constant the value of this constant we will get the value of the resulting equation or you can say the equilibrium constant value of the resulting equation so that will be k1 into k2 so you can write it as whenever we add reaction the value of equilibrium constant got multiplied get multiplied and reverse is also true that whenever we have to subtract any reaction the value of the equilibrium constant will get divided so this is the value we have to find out so whenever we will multiply this we will get our correct answer so and that will be value of kc will be k1 into k2 so the value of k1 is 2 into 10 to the power minus 2 and the value of k2 is 6 into 10 to the power minus 8 so when we will evaluate this equation we will get as 1.2 into 10 to the power minus 9 and that will be mole square mole square per liter square this will be the unit of the equilibrium constant kc for the resulting equation resulting reaction you can say thank you for class 6 to 12 itg and neat level Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.